I'm Queen Wolf AJ, and I'm going to be going over and talking about packs in Animal Jam Play Wild. Sorry for the not so great quality, but with a new recorder that I intended to work out, this is what we ended up with today. Alrighty, but we're gonna have to make it work. So if you are mostly a classic player and you don't know what packs are or what a pack run is, I'm gonna teach you guys. First off, I am not in a pack, so I decided to actually start one of my own. This is temporary, so it's not it's not actually a real pack, but I decided just to start it just so I could see the stats and kind of get you guys going on what it is. I randomly just put the name that came off the top of my head and at first it was Queen's Cool Kids, but then I decided to just make it Queen's Pack. And then I randomly selected a pack crest because I'm only going to be in this pack for literally five minutes. And bada boom, this is the ugly pack crest I decided to go with, but it will have to work for now. Oh my goodness, this pack crest looks like it would be like I would be aligned with Peck, but you know what? We're going to go with it. Alrighty, so to start off, if you don't know what a pack is, I'm going to go over it. Basically, it's just groups of jammers who like to hang out and do pack runs. It's basically like a club, but it can have up to 100 members. Have you ever been on AJ Classic and you're like, oh my gosh, I wish I could just like start a clan with my buddies? Well, in Animal Jam Play Wild, you can. I'm going to show you guys what some of the runs look like. Alrighty, so I went into a random run in the Alpha Hideout, which in my case is the Sir Gilbert Hideout. And basically, if you guys don't know what a pack run is, basically, you just run around and look for all these little snowman or whatever item is placed around the maps. This month, because it's winter, there is snowmen. In a pack run, you have five minutes to return as many as you can to an igloo. Now, of course, this is because I'm on a computer. I did not really grab any, and I just kind of wanted to show you guys, but yeah. By returning these snowmen to the igloo, as shown right now, you can win prizes for both you and your pack members. A common question I've got about packs is, are they competitive? And the answer to that is yes. Well, mostly. There is a leaderboard which many jammers fight hard to get on, but not all packs are aiming for the top. Some just want to hang out and meet new friends. As you can see to the left, Laugh Out Loud and Champions are head on in the current leaderboard. And of the all time leaderboard, Laugh Out Loud is first and Champions is third. But technically, Champions is second because the Jubilee Jammers have only two members and no longer do runs. But their past records and stats have remained the same. And you guys may be wondering well, Queen, are you a competitive runner or do you just like to hang out with friends? Now, this answer may come to a shock to you, but I'm actually super competitive when it comes to runs. As a matter of fact, I've actually been in Champions and Laugh Out Loud before. Although I didn't run with them for very long as I had school and I simply didn't have that much time for pack runs anymore, so I left. But it was a good decision. Running for the two highest teams on the leaderboard around the same time was a lot of fun, but it sure was stressful and it was a lot of pressure and time I had to dedicate to their runs to keep our spot and pull out on the top. I just didn't have time anymore. I actually plan to stay packless again, or if I do join back, I plan to not run as much. That's basically all I have on packs and what happened with me in packs. So if you guys have any other questions, drop them down in the comments. Or if you want me to make a part two going in more detail about the packs, I totally can. And that is all for the video. Thank you all so, so, so much for watching. Bye, guys!